We burning it up, step in the building, we turning it up Talking that shit, but they never admit when I said to them like I be murdering it and we living real good Mainstream, but it's hey everybody, it's your boy named Jarvis Davis here And today I want to talk about some shit that was based on the Eminem recovery track list and shit I feel like, I think that Tech 9 should have been on there Rick should have been on there Yellow Wolf should have been on there. Lil Wayne should have been on there. You know what I'm saying? Two Chain should have been on there. Crazy Bone should have been on there. Zero should have been on there. That's just my opinion because when I listen to them rapping shit, I feel like it's a meaning. You know what I'm saying? But I feel like I think like just imagine if it was a like if it's your favorite artist and you want that person to rap with that person and shit. I feel like, in my mind, that them motherfuckers should have been on there. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like Ice Cube should have been on there. You know what I'm saying? That's just my opinion. Or Dr. Dre, you know, they should have been on there. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they should have been on the track for the 2017 of the making. But they, they not. That's just my opinion. I just wish it was just one of my two main artists that I really like is Tag 9 and Crazy Bone, you know what I'm saying? I listen to them, you know what I'm saying? I listen to them every fucking time. And the reason why I listen to them, because it's just the type of music and type of beats that they have in the song, you know what I'm saying? And it's just, I feel like if that could have been a banger, you know what I'm saying? Just Eminem, Crazy Bone, and Tag 9 on one track together, you know what I'm saying? We all remember about the speed on Chris Calico, you know what I'm saying? Eminem, Tac Nine, they was that was lit. That to me that was a banger. Now, I think it was a banger for everybody, but I feel like it could have been a main banger with Eminem, Tac Nine, and Crazy Bone and shit, you know what I'm saying? But the re the revival or whatever, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully it be good, you know what I'm saying, like other people expected. But I feel like I feel like I think in my own opinion that I, it's just me, you know what I'm saying? I feel like if they going to, like, so many years, I feel like if they going to do something, you do it right. Give it what your fans want. Give it what, what the energy, you know what I'm saying? Like T.I., for instance, he could have been on there, you know what I'm saying? He could have been on a revival album, you know what I'm saying? If you going to revive some motherfuckers, revive us with Tech 9 and Crazy Bone, you know what I'm saying? I feel like that's just... Me, you know what I'm saying? I feel like it could have, the album, the track list could have been a little bit more longer. You know what I'm saying? Could have expanded out the business more, more uh, of the track list more. You know what I'm saying? With some good beats, with a music video, with all that, man. And I just feel like, I even was telling my my friends about the situation. I had to delete it, the other one, because I was really, I was really fucking pissed off. I was really upset Cause I, I actually fucked up the title, the name. You know what I'm saying? That's how pissed off I was. I wouldn't, I wasn't even concentrating right. I'm just like, well, damn, man, this album could have been a little bit way more better. I mean, I have to hear it, but still, regardless of the fact that it should be in Crazy Bone and Tag Nine on the fucking album. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, I was looking up on the internet, man. It said Two Chains ain't even on it. I'm like. What the fuck happened? You know what I'm saying? Like, what the hell? But my inputs on it, man, of the revival track list, you know what I'm saying? I feel like I think I could have been comfortable enough to buy the album. But I might buy the album, and then again, I might not. Because when I buy albums, I go to Best Buy, post it up on Instagram. Y'all already know this. That's why I got the Strange Music beanie cap on, you know what I'm saying? I just feel like it could have been like that, you know what I'm saying? It could have been to a point that... That track list, that when I seen the track list, I was like, oh, okay. I'm thinking in my mind, before the track list was even occurred, I feel like, damn, where's Tech 9 at? My, mind, my first attention in my mind thinking like, where's Crazy Bone? Where's Tech 9 at? On the fucking album, I didn't even see it. I'm like, oh my, oh my god, bro. Like, I was thinking, I was really thinking and hoping that they was on... Tech Nines album. Oh yes, and that uh, what's that rock band name? I be listening to Sniff Knock. Uh, I can't never pronounce, but y'all y'all understand what I'm coming from. Coley Taylor or some shit like that. He could have been on it. You feel me? 
But I mean, it could have been a banger, bro. Uh, one of them songs, you know what I'm saying? Just man, but for some reason, for all reason, everything happened for a purpose, you know what I'm saying? And I understand that, but I'm just stating that it could have been Tac Nine and Crazy Bone and, and the rest of the people who I request from the beginning of this video could have been on that album, you know what I'm saying? Could have been raw. Could have had Twister in it. You know what I'm saying? Could have had like, could have had man, so many people. You know what I'm saying? He could have made the album like a, a a double album. You know what I'm saying? Double. You know, like extra more. You know what I'm saying? Bonus tracks and shit like that. But hey, it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? If y'all think, if y'all think to a situation. That the album, whoever y'all wish could have been on the album. Let me know in the comment section. It's your boy named Jarvis Davis. And man, the name gonna be titled is Eminem Revival. You know what I'm saying? And when y'all listen to what I'm saying, then y'all understand where I'm coming from with this shit. Alright? I'm out. Stay good. Always stay positive. And man, I ain't never stopped doing YouTube at all. You know what I'm saying? Until the service be gone, but I doubt it's gonna be gone. Alright? At least that's being said. I'm out. Peace.